there were atrocities, large atrocities that occurred on October 7th. I think it's indisputable. You then asked me, would you consider it terrorism? I then replied to you, I think atrocities denote terrorism. Mm -hmm. However, I said I take the same attitude towards the perpetrators of those atrocities as, I, as the abolitionists in the United States took towards the Nat Turner Rebellion. Nat Turner, so you slave justify revolt. them, so you, you praise committed. them, so you Allow glorify them, and you honor them. That's Pierce, the reality. Pierce, 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 can I finish? Yeah. Can I finish? Yeah. Uh, Nat Turner and the slave revolt committed horrible atrocities. The ab abolitionists said horrible things happened. But they never condemned Turner. No, they Matt don't Turner. happen. They what are they, perpetrated what they by did people. Was, You're justifying they, what it. They did was, Finkelstein, allow me to this finish. This is the lowest point Pierce, you've ever please gotten tell them to, to stop. and you've gotten to low uh, points. Uh, uh, but this is the lowest Pierce, point you've gotten to, please, comparing these Pierce, rapists uh, please and these murderers to, well, I think to him, abolitionists. I think Alan, Alan, let is him the lowest point in your uh, history. Let him finish what he's trying to say. Sure. Thank okay, you. Let me have By the way, Matt Turner's rebellion. Okay. In Nat Turner's rebellion, they committed horrible atrocities, including beheading babies. That's a fact. However, the and abolitionists... you're justifying that. They did and you're not, justifying that. They did not... Please, Pierce, can you please tell him yeah, to I stop? think let him finish the point he's making, and then, then he respond. Okay. Thank you, thank you okay. so much. However, the abolitionists did not condemn the perpetrators. The abolitionists kept saying, we told you so. We told you so. We told you so. If you treat people like that, what happened with the slave revolt inevitably would happen. And I say, if you lock two million people in a concentration camp for 20 years, half of whom are children who were born into that concentration camp, don't react with shock and dismay and disbelief and indignation at what happened on October 7th. I have well, spent I the last react. 20 I, years, I, I have spent the last 20 years of my life studying what's been done to the people lying. of Gaza. And each time I reread what I wrote, I'm more, more firm than ever before. I will not condemn those people, even as I acknowledge that massive, unspeakable atrocities occurred on October 7th. Okay.